Hey beauties, hopping on today to do a shop with me, a Louis Vuitton. I thought it'd be super fun to hit up the mall and so if you guys are here for it and want to spend the day with me and go shopping and see what I got, then just keep so watching. So I'm just out and about today, finally left the house. There are days I literally don't leave the house for God knows how long, but today I've left the house, so that's good. <laughs> this is good news, right? But actually, we came to visit my husband's mom and she's at um assisted living so he goes to visit her he's moving her furniture around actually but we can't bring roxy in and we can't leave roxy home so usually i wait in the car i go in sometimes but mostly if we bring roxy i they won't let roxy in so i gotta stay in the car with roxy and she's in the back now sleeping so and my husband refuses he doesn't want to ever leave her he's obsessed with her i'm obsessed with her too but he's like nervous obsessed like he's terrified to leave her home that she's gonna hurt herself somehow <laughs> I don't know he's like he thinks he's scared something's gonna happen to her so he's so scared to leave her you know what I mean but um so that's why we bring her and then somebody gotta sit in the car with her cause she can't ever be alone so <laughs> so you're not it goes like that dog mom life you know dog dad life <laughs> so anyway guys um, yeah, at least it also was raining like crazy, you guys. Oh my god. It was like our house was shaking from the thunder. But it stopped now. Thank goodness. So, anyway. Um, yeah, people are like walking by looking at me now. Like, because they're, they're probably like, what? Because, you know. Anyway, this guy was just poor. This, everybody, you know, it's, it's a happy place here. Because everybody is thriving pretty much, you know, because they're like here my mother-in-law is doing so amazing she wasn't doing good on her own she wasn't eating she wasn't able to take care of herself wash herself now she looks gorgeous she gets her hair done she's socializing she made friends like my mother-in-law is like 70 something years old but she has made friends here that are like a hundred and something years old and they go out to lunch together you know down in the they have like a lunch area place and they supposedly the food is delicious and they have a uh, health you know healthy food for them because if she wasn't eating before like and she was she would ask like my brother-in-law bring her wendy's she was just eating Wendy's. she just only wanted to eat wendy's frost uh fries and a frosty which is not healthy you know so she was and then my husband and me she didn't want to eat we were trying to tell her to eat healthy she didn't want to eat healthy so here though they got her eating healthy they have therapy they do her hair she, they actually have a hair salon here so she gets her hair blown out she's it's like a totally different person when you see the pictures you're like who is, this is amazing because she looks so beautiful and uh they do they dress they help dress her so she gets dressed nice you know before she couldn't she was going around and you know she couldn't do anything she couldn't like she anyway you guys know what i'm saying but so anyway guys today i thought it'd be fun to hopefully i want to go to the store to the sephora <laughs> to sephora and you know they have new tom ford makeup i wanted to look at they have a new dolce gabbana perfume that i really wanted to smell the bottle looks so beautiful online but i was like no 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 allegra i'm i don't i don't like buying perfume i've done it before but buying perfume that without smelling it first it sounds like it's gonna smell but it's just not good to do i don't feel good about it so um i'm gonna go test it in the store the dolce gabbana i forgot the name of it but the bottle is beautiful and the notes sounded amazing i think it had pineapple in it oh my god it <laughs> sounded amazing so i really want to try that perfume out and also um yeah i gotta go for mri in a few days so i've been just praying about that that i get all good news so guys please give me your prayers i get all good news for my mri and i'm staying positive because i am close i was claustrophobic but i'm trying to change you guys i'm praying i'm meditating i'm staying positive i'm speaking into existence i love to go to the doctor <laughs> you know <laughs> i'm like trying to like speak it into existence like I said I love you know being healthy and going to the doctor these are my affirmations you know because it was actually more than the opposite but we won't go into that we're gonna stay in the positive place stay in the happy place 
And I just meditated even while I was waiting for my husband. I was just meditating on it and how, you know, I visualized myself going to get my MRI, how I'm happy there, everybody's so nice, which they truly are because I've been there before and everybody is so nice. So, you know, and then afterwards they have so many amazing restaurants by where I get my MRI. They have this Greek restaurant, amazing. They have Patsy's Pizza amazing i was even i haven't had pizza in years because i've been on my keto diet but i said maybe i'll treat myself to a slice of pizza you guys <laughs> i don't know i'm gonna do something crazy but the greek food is amazing and it's healthy because you can get a giant greek salad and it's and then they have like oh my god the tzatziki sauce is amazing the you know oh i should get that today actually there's a good greek restaurant right around the corner from here okay i'm gonna go get i'm gonna order that greek food because, um, you know, some places the tzatziki sauce is just unbelievable. And this is one of those places. And one of you beauties, Chrissy, asked me if I make tzatziki sauce. And I don't. I wish I did. But I, like, get a big one to go. And then I'll just eat it all week, you know. Because you can just dip your your chicken, your veggies into it. And it's, oh, it's amazing. So, actually, I'm going to do it. I'm going to get me a big it actually lasts but you know I'll eat the whole thing in a few days it's so good so I'm gonna go do that hopefully I'll go to the store Sephora and check out that perfume so hopefully you guys want to come along with me do a shop with me at Sephora maybe we'll see where the day got comes here to the mall Ooh, so happy so I'm gonna go see the new Tom Ford makeup the new perfume and See what so I headed into Neiman Marcus to check out the new Tom Ford collection, new Tom Ford makeup, and they had all the perfumes, so many beautiful ones, and then these are the new Tom Ford eyeshadow palettes, which look very nice. This is for the summer collection, but they didn't have the lips, so. Uh, they really didn't have anything that I was looking for. I was looking for the new Tom Ford lipstick, but maybe they'll have it at Sephora or Nordstrom, so guys see you. maybe I'll go Louis Vuitton and check it out so let's so I wound up heading to Louis Vuitton and trying on the new Louis Vuitton sunglasses and I really couldn't decide which ones to get but let me know what you guys think are the best ones one two or three and then they did have new bags in store they had these beautiful almas in different shades and different tones perfect for summer and then this beautiful kind of bucket bag this never full very beautiful for summer I love that so these I just got home and I wanted to show you what I got and do a Louis Vuitton unboxing and so here it is right here i just wound up getting this louis vuitton perfume i do have quite a few perfumes but um i actually only have two so this is my third so i can't wait to show you what it is exactly and do an unboxing and show you what i got so I wound up getting a perfume so that is the first clue and the first hint and this is the box that it comes in and it comes with this beautiful little drawer like packaging which I really love and so you take it out of the drawer and then there is the Louis Vuitton perfume and should I tell you guys okay let me tell you I got the Etrop Reeve perfume which smells so feminine so luxurious so fresh and I didn't know this but a trap reeve actually means dream catcher so I think that's so such a nice uh message because I love I'm a very dreamy person so I love dreams and dreaming and um so I really love the name of this perfume I didn't realize that I just love the scent and that's why I purchased it but I also did get my initials engraved on the bottle so i'm so happy about that because i didn't do that with my previous two perfumes and this one just is really me i'm surprised i didn't get it before but um it just smells so light and feminine and it's just such a beautiful they describe it as a magical scent a dreamy scent I think if you love Delina from Perfume de Marley, that pink perfume, you would absolutely love this. It is that same kind of notes, cheerful, lively, beautiful, fresh, young, 
just an absolutely gorgeous scent. It's also described as a shooting stars, a trail of shooting stars. It's just amazing. That's how Louis Vuitton described it. So it definitely makes you feel that way. It's just fresh, romantic, beautiful beautiful scent so i'm so happy that i got this and i'll be back to do another review and let you know how it wears and things like that but i'm so happy i got this so thank you for spending the day with me doing a shop with me louis vuitton and i'll be back soon beauty so i'll see you guys soon